Hey guys, Jared here. So if you already see, uh, seen my uh, Nexus 4 um, Sandage Mod 10.2 Android 4.3.1 M1 <laughs> update video, uh, you probably don't need to watch this one. That's it. If you do have an HTC One, uh, you might be interested in this. Huh, looks like my wife dropped the phone and she put a little scratch on it right about there. Anyways, um, yes, so uh, Sandage Mod team updated to M1. So for those of you out there that have Sandage Mod and are unaware of what uh, M1 is, uh, basically it's a series of updates as they work towards their, or edge towards their final and most stable um, version of Sandage Mod. Uh, it'll go all the way up to M3 and then I believe either, I, I can't remember if it was either M3 is the final stable version or if there's one other one just called final. But either way, we're at M1 now. So if you do have Sandage Mod installed in your HTC One, go ahead and um, update now to the latest version. Uh, for those of you wondering what the change log consists of, really nothing too important. Um, again, as we start edging towards the final version, it's just going to be very, very minor um, little updates here and there. Uh, for the majority of it, there's a ton of translation updates. So for those of you that are uh, living in non-English speaking countries or natively English speaking countries, um, you should have all sorts of new translation updates um, throughout the entire system. Uh, another little update they did was um, add some more sand mod wallpapers from Matthew Hanley. So as we kind of go through here, you can see that we do have uh, various different sort of nature related wallpapers. Um, really great. It's going to look fantastic on this high resolution 1080p display. Uh, unfortunately, we don't have any more of those actual sort of official Sanjay Mod wallpapers where you see their um, Sanjay Mod Sid guy um, in a lot of the different wallpapers, which I kind of miss, but whatever. It's not the end of the world. Um, furthermore, on top of that, uh, for those of you that um, are watching this, don't have an HTC One, but perhaps you have a Sony Xperia device or something like that, something with a dedicated camera button. Um, they've done something so that if you half press the shutter button, it'll launch the application. Um, double tap and the home button will take you into the camera application as well. Um, just little things like that. But other than that, there really isn't any um, huge, huge updates here. Uh, just jumping into the settings here, of course, I've gone through this before on the HTC One, but where you're going to find more device specific um, changes, things like that is in the more settings here. Um, uh, unlike the Nexus 4, we have things like color calibration and gamma calibration here we only have vibrator intensity and uh, launch music application as soon as you um, toss in uh, uh, a 3.5 millimeter cable whether it be obviously auxiliary or your headphones but other than that nothing else is new here there's no exciting changes um, I mean it's Android 4.3.1 it's a very stable version so if you guys are looking for a custom ROM that is super stable um, and you don't have to worry about things breaking all the time. Um, obviously, Sanj Mod 10.2 uh, is definitely the way to go. Uh, for those of you wondering when uh, Sanj Mod 11 is going to be released, they didn't give any ETAs, which is common practice with Sanj Mod or at least any true developer, uh, rec uh, um, reputable developer, developer, I should say. Um, though they did comment saying that as soon as they get uh, Sanj Mod 10.2 10 completely finalized, um, they will be starting to work on uh, the Android 4.4 version of Sanj Mod, which should be exciting with all the new features and enhancements that they've included. Uh, anyways, guys, that's it for this one, though. Like I said before, if you do have an HTC One running Sandage Mod, go ahead and jump into your settings menu here. Scroll all the way down to About Phone, and then up here at the top, you'll see Sandage Mod Updates. Go ahead and click on that bad boy there, and you should be able to get it. Um, anyways, that's it, though, guys. Thanks for watching, as always. If you like the video, click the Likes button. If you're new to the channel, subscribe for more videos. Uh, but thanks, as always, for watching it again, and we'll see you in the next one. Cheers, guys.